the first post-war training camp for army volunteers gave Malaya's part-time soldiers a taste of the real thing. They took part in a 24-hour anti-terrorist operation under actual service conditions. Keen as mustard, their only complaint was that they weren't out long enough. They were also disappointed at not bumping into any terrorists. Volunteers for the Federation Military Police took the opportunity of the march past for a bit of fancy work, just to show that the camp was not all work and no play. 400 men attended the two-week camp at Port Dixon. They found the first week pretty hard going, their CO said, since most of them had only just left their office chairs. But after a week of exercises and the outdoor life, they'd loosened up and were ready for anything. GOC Malaya, Lieutenant General Stockwell, congratulated the men on their drill and bearing. He told them that no country could afford a large regular army in peacetime and that they were fulfilling a vital role in the development of their country. Ismail bin Ahmad was one of the seven sergeants and potential officers to earn a certificate of proficiency. When the camp was over, the men had toughened up considerably and went home in very good shape, satisfied with their new friendships and a job well done.